Of the many battles that moms face daily. Stop it with the monkey noises. Few are fraught with more passion and determination than the battle that always begins. Mom, can we get a, in this case, hedgehog? A small, spiny mammal native mostly to Asia and Africa. When I saw them, I thought they were the cutest thing alive. I said, we're not getting a hedgehog. I'd never heard of a hedgehog. That's how exotic pet debates always start. What makes this one between Rebecca Weeks and her son Judson different is how it ends at the Lawrence, Kansas City Hall. So he actually presented you materials? Absolutely. Mayor Absolutely. Mike Dever. Portfolio of information with photographs about uh, hedgehogs. But I'm getting ahead of myself. All sorts of information this all started more than two years ago, as is typical. Judd argued owning a hedgehog would teach him responsibility. And once I tried to prove myself about that, she goes like, why don't you start early? Go take care of the dogs. Oh. And I'm like, oh, I didn't think that was going to be involved. <laughs> So he took care of the dogs, thinking that would earn him a hedgehog. But his mom is a lawyer, and she wasn't done. She started researching, and she learned, whoa, they're illegal. I thought, oh, righty then. <laughs> <laughs> End of story. That's right. <laughs> okay. Not um, quite. My name is Judson King, and I am talking about hedgehogs. Last month, all, Judd put on his best suit and tie to tell city council there was no logical reason to disallow hedgehogs. And they would not deplete any natural animals to the state of Kansas if they were released. He got up and he just delivered it like a pro. In the handouts I gave you. It was amazing. You know, one of the best laid out arguments uh, that I've seen since I've been on the commission the last two years. Needless to say, he's going to be about right here. It is now perfectly legal to own a hedgehog in Lawrence, Kansas. But if you really want to, you can pet him. Judd named his new pet Little Luke. Is it as much fun as you thought it would be? Oh, it's a lot more, too. Really? He is prickly sometimes, but he doesn't charge at you that much. Oh, that's good. Plus, Judd says this whole experience has taught him a valuable lesson. Mm -hmm. If you're a kid, if you don't like a law, if you feel it's wrong, then it's unfair, change it. Steve Hartman, CBS News, Lawrence, Kansas.